welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be sharing a quick review with you. Today I'm going to be reviewing my new foundation by Guerlain. This is my new Lingerie Depot Natural Perfection Foundation. I recently hauled this in a Sephora haul um, on my channel, so if you haven't seen that haul, go ahead and check it out. But today I thought I'd stop in real quick and give you my thoughts on this foundation. So I've been using it um, a little over a week now and I have a solid opinion about it. So let's get into the review. First, I'm going to give you guys some information directly from Sephora's website. So this is the Guerlain Lingerie Depot Natural Perfection Foundation with SPF 20. This foundation comes in 14 shades. I'm in the shade 05N, and that N is for neutral. So it's 05N Deep. That's the name of the um, shade I'm in. So this is a full to medium coverage foundation. It's marketed towards everyone from sensitive, normal, dry combination, and oily skin. The finish is intended to be a natural finish. Again, it has SPF 20. It's supposed to be a natural looking skin fusion texture foundation. And so, I'll give you a little blurb here. So, Guerlain's Lingerie Depot Natural Perfection Foundation SPF 20 enhances the complexion for a perfect, long lasting, and natural looking result on all skin tones. This foundation contains SPF 20 and it's Fresh, light texture glides on the, and contours to the face like a second skin to enhance your natural beauty all day long. It's formulated with Guerlain's technology and biofusion micro mesh, a combination of contouring and smoothing stretch fiber, fibers that are infused with natural silk and linen fibers so that you're in perfect affinity with the skin. Hydrating agents provide softness and comfort throughout the day. Choose from our universal range of 14 natural looking shades, every skin tone, cool, neutral, and warm. So this has no parabens, no sulfates, and um, again, it's made with this Guerlain's technology biofusion micro mesh. Um, and I'll read what that is. So the Guerlain's technology biofusion micro mesh is an unprecedented combination of contouring and smoothing stretch fibers, including natural silk and linen. So that's some kind of background on that foundation. This foundation uh, retails for $63. The bottle size, so here's the packaging that it came in. These, this is one point fluid ounce of product. And just give you some details. It's a really nice kind of luxury, luxurious glass bottle. So let me give you my thoughts on this foundation as, like I said, I've been using it consistently for this past week or so. So I have noticed that this foundation is definitely, for me, more of a full coverage versus medium. It definitely covers up any problem areas that I may have. And I really, really love like the leverage level of coverage. I feel like I do go a little heavy on the product. I could probably use a little less. I use about three pumps for my full face. And I feel like, you know, I could definitely take that down to about two pumps, even a pump and a half, because the coverage that I get is quite sufficient. So the texture of this foundation, it's definitely a light weight foundation. And it has this element of moisture that you feel as you as it glides on your face. It feels as though you're applying a moisturizer to your face when you're putting this foundation on, which I enjoy. Now, as I mentioned previously on my channel, I have very oily skin. So hearing that something sounds moisturizing, gliding, it sounds like something I would shy away from. But for some reason, I definitely enjoy how soothing this foundation feels on my skin especially in the winter i would say i do have to kind of blot and powder throughout the day as you can already see i've only had this foundation on for maybe 30 minutes and i have a little bit of a dewy shine to my skin so this is a foundation that i have to kind of like look out for especially with my oils my oils will break through this and i will get that kind of extra glow because it's intended to be a natural finish it's not completely dewy it's definitely not matte but it's not that satin finish that 
you do get a glow with this foundation, but it's a glow that I feel like I can tolerate. Also the color selections, I feel like, you know, 14 shades from what I remember when I was trying to do the, um, to match, color match myself with this foundation, there were pretty much about four shades that I was looking in. Um, and the deeper shade, I think it's six, was one of the deeper shades. I tried that on. It looked in the bottle like it would suit me, but when I tried it on, it was way deeper than my skin tone. Like I couldn't wear that at all. And then this one in the bottle, it looked like it didn't, it wouldn't work for me either. It looked a little too, um, a little too light. Um, again, this is the neutral undertones. I definitely have neutral undertones. I'm, I don't have a lot of red undertones. Um, I appreciate the fact that there is some selection for deeper skin tones. As far as long wearing, this foundation I usually wear it at minimal 12 hours. The evening errands and my foundation is still in place. I love that. This foundation is definitely... Um, it's not going to get blotchy through the day. You don't have to worry about if you have to touch up or if you have a long day. This foundation is really holding up nicely. Um, and I appreciate that, especially, like I said, long days and all. So that pretty much is it, guys. That's my thoughts on the Guerlain Lingerie de Peau Foundation. I believe there is a heavier version, like a more full coverage version of this. And this is intended to be like the everyday natural finish foundation. I'm really enjoying using it. Like, I'm really glad that I chose to pick this up, especially during the winter. If you have any other questions or any other comments, please feel free to let me know in the comments below. And I'll see you next time. Thanks again for watching today. Bye.